Hello my dear friends and my dear students. Today we will do the subtraction but without borrowing. Yes, we will not do the tradition method today. We will do the subtraction without borrow. Let's start. See the first question. We have 92 minus 44. We will not do from the right to left. We will start from the left side. Let's start. First, you have to understand the concept that is the base complement concept. That is the number, suppose 1 is here. 1 complement will be 9. How we have to make the total of 10? 1 plus 9 is equal to 10. So, 1 complement is 9 and 9 complement will be 1. And then in this way, 2 plus 8 is 10. So, 2 complement is 8 and the 8 complement will be 2. Then 3 is for 7 because 3 plus 7 is 10. Then 4 for 6 and then 5 for 5. Now let's start. We have to start from the right side. Yes, let's do. 9 minus 4. Yes, we can subtract the term 9 minus 4. So it will be 5. But we can't subtract now next that 4 from the 2. So, what we have to do? We will cut this term and we will write 4 here. Means the 1 less. Now, we have to take care that 4 complement will be 6. 4 complement will be 6. And 6 will be added to this upside number. Then 6 plus 2 is 8. And 8 will be written here. And we have got the answer. 48. Very easy. Okay, let's do one more example to clear you more. Okay, now 3. 3 we can subtract from 7. Very easily that is 4. Now 9 we can't subtract from 8. So what we will take care? We will cut this number. We will write the less number and we will take care of the 9 complement. The 9 complement is 1. What we will do? We will add the complement to the upside. So, 8 plus 1 is 9. So, the answer will be 39. Let's do one more example. Okay. Now, 4 is subtracted from the 7. That is 3. But 6 we can't subtract. So, what we have to do? If we can't subtract the next number, we will cut the previous number unless number 1. Now we will take care of the 6 complement. That 6 complement will be 4 because 6 plus 4 is 10. So what we will do? We will add 5 plus 4. Okay. 5 plus 4 will be 9. Now in the next 7 we can't subtract from 6. So it will also will be number less. We have to move forward. Now 7 complement. What is the 7 complement? That is 3. So, we will add 3 to 6. 6 plus 3 will be 9. 9 will be written here. So, this is done. So, the answer is 289. So, in this way, we can subtract the biggest term also. Let's move. 3, yes, 3 can subtract from the 7. That will be 4. Now, 7, we can't subtract. So, what we will do? We will write here number 1 less. Now we will take here 7 complement that is 3. So we will add 3. 6 plus 3 will be 9. Now 4 we can't subtract from 2 again. So what we will do? We will cut here. We will write 8 and 4 complement is 6. 6 plus 2 will be 8. Okay, now move on the next. Now 8 can't again subtract from 3. We will cut here and we will write 7 and 8 complement. 8 complement is 2. Then 3 plus 2 that is equal to 5. Now next 3 we can subtract. So 5 will be written as it is. If we can subtract the next term very easily means the direct. We have to write the same number. Now 3 will be subtracted from the 9 that is 6. So this is the answer. I think you got this point. Now move on the last one. After this you will be genius in subtraction. 
Yes, 9 minus 5, that is 4. Now, 5 we can't subtract from 2. Do practice with me. Yes, very good students. It will return here 3. Yes, pause the video and you have to comment in the... Okay, you can do it. 5. 5 can't subtract from the 2. So, what we will do? We will take the complement of 5 will be 5. So, we will add 5 to it. 5 plus 2 is 7. Now, 7 we can subtract. So, 7 will be written as it is. And 8 minus 7 will be 1. So, we will write here 1. Now, 7 we can't subtract from 5. So, what we will do? We will hear the number less. That will be 0. So, the next one that is 7. 7 complement is 3. So, we will add 3 upside. 5 plus 3 will be 8. And now the last, we can't subtract 9 from 2. So, we will cut the previous number that will be 7. And 9 complement will be 1. So, plus 1. 2 plus 1 is 3. So, 3. So, here is the answer. I think students, you got the concept that is subtraction without borrowing. If you want to know about how to subtract the term from 10, 100, 1000, you can see that video. Thank you. Bye-bye. See you in the next.